Welcome to Peace Code Radio. I'm Sheena Luxor, the Queen of Light, and I have an amazing special guest on today, Professor Dawson, who has a PhD in philosophy. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Thank you, Sheena. It's good to be here. Do you think the world would be a more peaceful place if women in charge, or do you have a problem with women being in charge? I respect women that are trying to, to achieve certain things in, in, in life, you know, but men are the rulers. Men are the ones who are in charge, who make the decisions. And what, why is that? Why, why, why men? How can you have a man in the military and, and the woman being in charge, what, in charge of the military? I mean, take for instance, th there are certain things in the military that, that the woman is, is not authorized or, or cannot do. I mean, a, a woman in so, combat so you, on the so line... Are you saying women aren't always qualified? You know, it's not... Women are qualified for certain jobs, certain things in the military, but when you're talking about combat itself, leading men in combat, then, you know, there's a fine line. There's a fine line here. Women, women are capable of so much. And they are. Women are capable in, in a support structure. They you know, can lead as well. Women can lead. Look at me. I have my own radio show. To certain aspects of it, yes. Women can lead in certain aspects of it. Now you're talking about, you know, ruling, ruling the world in essence. No, it, 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 that should be left for a man to do. So, Shane, let me ask you a question. If you were the president of the United States, what would be the first thing you would do? Well, well, you seem to be hesitant. Foreign policy, hunger. I mean, th there's so much war. There's so much going on. What exactly? I mean, what, what would you do? So you didn't even give me a chance to answer. You, just because you're a man, you think you're in charge. Give a girl a chance to speak. I definitely would start with hunger. Get food. You can give them to the homeless. They may not have money, but who cares? Like you said, with the currency, okay. make it all the same. Now, you mentioned hunger. Now. You know, you, you, you've been making it clear, your radio session is about peace. You, okay, you're trying to bring peace to the world, permanent peace, but then you go from, from hunger being first on your list. Now, shouldn't peace be something that you should be addressing first? Hunger I mean, is part of the peace. If we have hungry people, they're fighting and angry because they're starving. Hunger can do so much to a person's mind. They can make a sane person go crazy. If we give them food, there goes half the battle right there. Becomes peace.